Where the hell have you been, dude? Gee, Scott, we've been looking for your uploads and they're nowhere. <clears throat> What's up, everybody? I'm back. Um, I've had a very busy week. Uh, you know, Winko is, uh, is starting to slow down a little bit. Um, it's starting to ease up a little bit. But uh, as you guys know, I last left off with you guys uh, saying how I picked up a fourth job. Now, it's only like half an hour or whatever, so it's no big deal. It didn't really make that much of a difference. However, uh, now my primary job uh, has offered me to um, assist when needed uh, if, uh, cause they, they're throwing in, uh, some of us to go in at night, um, you know, three to four hours or whatever. And, uh, <clears throat> they, they asked me, uh, if this, this person needs help because they don't really don't want, uh, them to work more than, than just a few hours because they're already, uh, working their regular eight hours or more in the morning. So, um, they asked me, if I'd like to assist them, if, uh, if, uh, they're getting a little too swamped to do it in that, that three to four hours. Um, I think most of them are doing like three hours cause, uh, that'd be a lot of, a lot of overtime and, uh, you know, they, they don't want, uh, their workers being overworked. Um, and, uh, you know, being o overwhelmed. So, um, so I, I agree to that. So uh, it's almost like I have uh, five things going on right now in a sense. So, um, but anyways, it's, it's been pretty busy. It's starting to slow down a little bit. I'm also starting to get a, a lot more efficient uh, with with my jobs and getting them done a little quicker and stuff. So, um, you know, stuff is kind of easing up a little bit, but I've just been very busy. Uh, and I, I really want to do daily uploads. I really do. Uh, I think that it'll be valuable, um, you know, not only for my own accountability, for, but for people that may watch my stuff in the future. You know, it, it, it's nice to have that day-to-day, uh, -day, you know, how, how are things going? What am I struggling with? Um, am I in a plateau? Uh, did I break and uh, eat something unhealthy? Um, which brings me to another thing I wanted to talk about. Uh, you guys are seeing a very, a very uh, different me, um, and and I owe it to you guys. Uh, you guys are encouraging me to uh, do really well and everything, um, you know. But I I I kind of wanted to to create this channel so that people could see. Uh, you know, those, those struggles when you give in and you eat a donut or something like that, you know, and that hasn't really been happening. Um, I've, I've had days, uh, yesterday, in fact, where I, I eat, I eat, uh, really well. Um, I eat, uh, probably more than I, than I have to. Um, I am feeling legitimately that hungry though. Uh, but, um, you know, that's, that's about all I have really, uh, struggled with i haven't cheated on my diet i haven't you know so i guess uh the point i'm trying to trying to bring across is you guys haven't really seen the me uh that has struggled with weight loss um like hardcore given given in to temptation a lot and everything and you know that's what's happened every other weight loss journey so i guess where, where i'm going with this is i just want those of you to know uh that that are struggling like I did and everything um first of all make a youtube channel or or go on instagram or or whatever you want to do it it's great for accountability it's 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 wonderful to have those people looking out for you uh got your back and everything and uh it, it makes you do that much more when you know that there's people watching you that are rooting for you and uh want to see you succeed and uh you don't want to get it, get on camera here and tell them that you failed, you know? And so, um, but you know, almost everybody you meet is, is going to be very supportive of you. They're going to understand, uh, if you do fail. Um, <clears throat> but it, it's kind of like, e even then, even though you know that they're not going to bash you or anything like that, it's still, uh, you still don't want to 
tell people that uh, you're not doing good, you know. Um, so that's something that you should do first and foremost. But uh, the point I want to get across is for those of you who are struggling a lot, like I have in the past, every other time I've tried to lose weight, and you, you, you're giving in to stuff that you don't need to be uh, eating and everything like that. Um, I just want you guys to realize that I am the same as you. Okay. Uh, I've been doing really good uh, this time around. Um, and like I said, it's it's mostly thanks to the people that are watching me here. Uh, having that accountability has been wonderful. But I want to... I want to get across to you that I am the same as you. Um, no matter, no matter how many times you're giving into food, uh, that you shouldn't, no matter how many donuts you're eating or cake pieces of cake you're eating. Uh, if you know, no matter how many times you take a trip to McDonald's and you know, you're struggling and everything, I want you to realize that that has been me. Okay. So if you're struggling on your weight loss, um, I know you haven't really seen me struggle in that respect much um, uh, on this channel, but uh, which is kind of why I made the channel because I wanted to document the reality of uh, when you go on a weight loss journey, how hard it is, and uh, you know how many times I I give in and stuff like that. But you know it kind of <laughs> it kind of ended up. Uh, uh, becoming what has kept me from doing that um but i just want to get the point across that uh those of you who are struggling hardcore those of you that are finding it hard not to give in and stuff and that are giving in or whatever the case may be i am the same as you what you're seeing uh seems like i am uh being very um doing very well uh I'm staying on top of things and everything like that, and that's kind of that's kind of the only version of me that you guys are seeing, um, which is wonderful. But I want those of you who are struggling to understand that I am just like you, um, even though you're seeing me do do pretty decent with this this journey this time around. Uh, I have my my background is one of a very very lazy person um except except for work i've always uh had good work work ethic and everything but um the real me is has always been quite frank, frankly a lazy person uh gorging on food eating fast food every day and everything like that and you guys aren't really seeing that on this channel so i just want to get that point across i'm just like you um so you know start up start up your own uh youtube channel or instagram or something like that because it's great for accountability um i just want to get the point across that i am just like you so if i can be be fairly strict if i'm doing pretty well or whatever you can do it too um i it, it has been extremely hard for me in the past and stuff and you know you guys haven't really seen seen uh that you know you haven't seen me really give in much and stuff which is why i want to i know i'm reiterating it a lot here but that's why i want to get that point across that i'm just like you so um make no mistake that i know exactly what you <clears throat> excuse me i know exactly what you're going through here so um i encourage you to start up your own uh documentation of it uh that's really, really helped me out, obviously. Um, but uh, at the very least, get in contact with me. Um, I have, I, I've posted on my, on my channel, on the main page. I've got my Instagram on there, my Facebook, uh, my Twitter. Uh, that's not super active, so I don't know how, how frequently I, I would respond to you on that. Um, but uh, reach out to me. Uh, you know, if you're struggling or whatever, I assure you, I know what you're going through. Um, all right, that, that, uh, I could have summed that up, but <laughs> I don't think I'm going to have time to edit this video or whatever. I got a lot of stuff going on. Uh, as, as you may recall from previous videos, Tuesday 
Uh, I am making be my uh, my rest day from everything. Um, there's a cup. Uh, I still have to go in and do Vortman's cookies and stuff for for like half an hour or whatever. And uh, starting the first of uh, April, I'm going to be doing research every day as well. So there'll be a couple hours that I'm working or whatever. But other than that. Um, I'm taking that one one day a week to just completely relax, not worry about stuff and everything. So I'm compiling a lot of of catching up on uh, like cleaning my apartment and everything like that on Wednesdays. So um, even though it's a day off, more or less, uh, I'm probably still not going to be able to do much editing and everything. So I'm sorry if this this video is long, but it is what it is. Uh, it's just how I have to do things right now because I got a lot going on. <clears throat> um, okay, so daily, I didn't, I didn't remember to weigh this morning, um, and I, I had already got my coffee in, uh, drank some water and all kinds of stuff, and uh, before I recalled that I hadn't weighed in yet, so. This morning's weight is not going to be accurate, so I'm, I'm just not even going to going to bother. But yesterday's weight was 267.6, so that's pretty decent. Um, last last Wednesday, I forgot about the weekly uh, stats update, uh, so week nine is going to be missing here. But this is week ten now, um, so. 267.6 puts me at 33.2% body fat and four pounds lost this week. That that's a that's decent amount of weight loss, but I'm in a challenge. So um, you know I'm I'm happy that I'm losing weight. I'm and I'm losing it at a at a very decent pace. You know if I'm losing four pounds in a week, but I got this challenge going. Uh, that means that I need to beast out. I need to get stuff accomplished um so you know i've got a lot going on i'm tired and everything but i'm not going to use it as an excuse there's there's a couple less than a couple weeks left in this challenge i can beast out for that amount of time so um i'm gonna start trying to like uh maybe get into the gym uh every day until the end of this challenge and stuff i gotta step it up if i want to do this challenge i'm serious about these challenges I want to get it done, so uh, that's 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 the way things are gonna go. So I'm gonna I'm gonna bust out this challenge. Like I've said before, I'm not gonna look at this camera and tell you at the end of this challenge that I did not do enough to make the challenge. Okay, you can't control if your weight stalls. You can't control you know stuff like that. But what I can control is my diet. Uh, getting more exercise in, um, I, I can be fasting more, you know, stuff like that. That's stuff I can control. Um, and that's the type of thing that I'm not going to look at this camera at the end of this challenge and say I didn't do enough of. So, um, I'm going to step it up. I want to get this challenge accomplished. So, you know, look for that. Uh, I'm going to go into another fast today. Oh, which reminds me, um, Red Delicious Apple and Mika Fasting Weight Loss did like a three-day fast together, and I had hopped on board, and then I didn't get my daily updates in uh, because I had so much going on and everything. So um, if you guys are watching, uh, I almost did it. <laughs> what happened is on the third day, uh, I woke up late. I was running late for work. I ended up being an hour late for work. Um, and thank God my employers didn't castrate me. Um, I ended up showing up really late for work. So in the, in the uh, stressed out morning I had that day, my only thought in my head was getting something that had caffeine in it. And we have what's called a boneyard... Uh, at work uh, of, of drinks that like broke open or something like that or any, anyways uh, you, we're allowed to once in a while go in there and uh, uh, grab a grab a drink or whatever and so anyways my only 
thought at the time was getting something that had caffeine in it because I needed to wake up and get going. And the only thing that was there was a was a Starbucks coffee drink. Um, and my only concern was getting caffeine in. I, it didn't dawn on me that that was going to break my fast. Uh, and not only that, but it had like 36 carbs in it or something like that. Uh, so, um, I still benefited it from, benefited from it, uh, really well. Um, but I didn't technically complete all three days. So, uh, I wish I would have realized what I was doing. Um, I could have just went up into the break room, got some black coffee, uh, and did it that way, uh, had I been thinking straight, but I was just, so I, I wasn't even awake yet, because I was rushing to work, I was, you know, woke up late and everything, so, technically I didn't complete it with you guys, um, so, but, uh, anyways, so let's move on here, this is gonna be a long video, man, maybe, maybe I can edit it a little bit, but anyways, so, 267.6 was where I was at yesterday. Uh, like I said yesterday, I ate good. Um, uh, I probably ate a little more than I had to, but, uh, you know, um, my body probably needed it anyways. It's all healthy food, so I'm not too concerned about it. But, so this morning, I probably would have woke up at like 270 or something. So, uh, but... I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to drop right back down. So, and I'm certain a fast today. Um, and then, uh, you know, I, I, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to do at least like three days again or whatever. So, uh, everything will drop back down. Everything will be all right. Everything will be kosher. So, um, yeah. So, and then that's my week, week 10 stats, four pounds lost, which brings me to 13 pounds out of 29 lost in the big big gym challenge so that's decent but that leaves me with 16 pounds to lose and we have 11 days left so in 11 days i gotta lose 16 pounds that's more than a pound a day so i need to buckle up i need to really really beast out here probably i'm probably going to do a lot of fasting um I'm going to try to get into the gym, uh, even though I have all these jobs and stuff, you know, uh, I can handle it for the short period of time. I, I do believe, um, I'm capable of a lot and I'm seeing that more and more. So I think I got it. I, I think I'll be all right. Um, so yeah, 16 pounds in 11 days. That's going to be a tough, uh, tough thing to do, but, um, I've accomplished some pretty crazy stuff. I met the last challenge. It was like uh, 12 pounds in 10 days. I ended up uh, having to do like 12 pounds in 10 days. Uh, and I pulled it off. Uh, and that was before I did that water drop thing or whatever. Um, I, I weighed myself and I announced that I had met the challenge before doing that. So um, it's not it's not like I, I only met the challenge because I dropped some water or whatever. Um, and for those of you who, who don't know why I dropped water, uh, it's cause I, I accidentally filled myself up with way too many electrolytes. Um, and so I was holding on to a ton of water and it wasn't, uh, accurately depicting what I actually weighed and stuff like that. So anyways, uh, you can find a pr the previous video explaining that. <clears throat> all right. So go check out all these people on this challenge. Um, I haven't been able to, to follow people, uh, as often as I'd like, but from what I see, everybody's still doing pretty well. Uh, everybody's sticking with it. Um, I'm so proud of you guys. Uh, and I'm going to try to catch up on some videos here. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I think, uh, I think that'll wrap it up for this video. Sorry it's so long, but I got a lot of stuff I've been wanting to talk about, but I haven't been finding the time to do the daily uploads. Um, I might just do, uh, live and drive like, uh, Keto Ozzo is doing. Um, that may be, that may be what I have to do if I want to keep doing the daily uploads. Uh, so maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll just do a live and drive, uh, for, uh, you know, a daily chat or whatever like that. And then I'll just do my weekly stats on Wednesday. Um, 
and then I'll try try to get out uh, some you know maybe Tuesday I'll try to on Tuesdays I'll try to get out some uh, videos of other content like I used to do like uh, you know keto recipes uh, and uh, you know like research um, going over research in the dieting community and everything uh, you know but I guess it, it'll depend on if that's a lot of work to do on the day that's supposed to be my rest day. So, uh, you know, we'll we'll see how it happens. So, but maybe what my plan is going to be is to do a daily live and drive, um, so I don't have to edit and everything. Um, you know, I just I I want my videos to be be kind of smooth and enjoyable, but I kind of don't have any any choice at this point. Um, so, uh. I really can't do a lot of editing or whatever. That takes a lot of time out of my day, and I just don't have the time. So that's probably going to be uh, the plan. Um, and then I'll do my weekly update video every Wednesday, uh, which will be an actual video, um, hopefully edited. Uh, and yeah, I guess that'll that'll probably be the plan from now on. So hopefully I'll be able to still still do daily updates uh from here on um yeah i think uh i think that'll be the plan anyways guys uh let's wrap it up this is gonna be a long video uh, i'm gonna have to probably edit some of this anyways much love guys thank you for sticking around i know i've been away for for uh well it's been almost a week um uh it's been like six days or something so Sorry about that, guys. I just had a lot going on, and I just really, I wasn't taking any time for myself whatsoever. Um, so, I, I needed to have some time for myself. Um, so, but I think if I just do a live and drive uh, every day, um, I'm really not uh, taking any extra time out of my day. So, maybe that's what I'll do from now on. Anyways, much love, guys. Thank you for sticking around. Uh, we'll talk to you tomorrow. Peace.